In this video, we're going to learn about microscopy, which just means the use of microscopes. So we'll cover what a microscope is, what the terms object, image, and magnification mean, the different parts of a light microscope, and finally, how to use a light microscope. To start off, we need to know what a microscope is. So a microscope is a tool that we use in science to make things look much larger than they actually are, and so help us see tiny details. For example, we often use microscopes in biology to look at cells, which we can't see with the naked eye, but can see with a microscope. Before we go any further, we need to introduce the terms object and image. In microscopy, the term object refers to the real object, or the sample that you're looking at. So if we had some onion cells on our microscope slide, then the cells themselves would be the object. The term image, on the other hand, refers to the image that we see when we look down the microscope. For example, if we were to look down this microscope, we might see something like this. So this would be our image whereas the object is the actual onion cells on the microscope slide that we're looking at. This brings us nicely to the next term you need to know, magnification, which we can define as how many times larger the image is than the object. So if the image appeared 1,000 times larger than the object, then the magnification would be times 1,000. Next, let's move on to look at the different parts of a light microscope. Supporting the whole thing is the base at the bottom, and then the arm that connects the bottom to the top. Then we have some kind of light source, which on some microscopes will be a lamp, but in this case is just a mirror reflecting the light from the room. And just above it is the stage, which is where we put our microscope slide. Then in the top half, we have all of our lenses. So we normally have three objective lenses, which we can choose between, and each have different magnifications. And then also an eyepiece lens, which has a fixed magnification, and sits just below where we look into the microscope. Then the last things to notice are the body tube here, and the coarse and fine focusing knobs, which we can turn to help us get the image in focus. The last thing we need to cover are the main steps of how to use a light microscope. For first, we need to set up the microscope near a window or a lamp to make sure there's enough light, and angle the mirror to direct the light upwards. This will reflect the light up through the hole in the stage. We then need to take our specimen, which is the scientific word for whatever it is you'll be looking at, and place it on a thin glass plate called a slide. Next, we take our slide with the specimen on, place it onto the stage, and secure it. This means we put it just here, so the light reflected shines through the specimen and up through the microscope. And now that our slide is in place, we can look through the eyepiece lens and adjust the focus. So first, we turn the coarse focus knob to get a rough image, and then we can turn the fine focus knob to fine tune it until we have a clear, magnified view of our specimen. Finally, this part here, where the objective lenses are, can rotate to switch to an objective lens with a higher magnification. Then you can adjust the focus again to bring the specimen back into clear view. If you haven't heard yet, you can find all of our videos on our website cognito.org. You'll also find questions, flashcards, exam style questions, and past papers. And we track all of your progress so that you always know what to study next. So sign up for free by clicking here or browse our playlist here on YouTube.